How to create and edit a new email template. First, to access your email template area, you need to log into your iBoomerang back office. Simply go to my.iBoomerang.com and you will use your user ID and your password. Once you have logged in, you will locate your My Tool Set and click on Email Template Tool. Once you are in the Email Template Tool section of your iBoomerang back office, you will see a series of selections at the top. To create a new template, simply go to Manage Templates. Once you are in the Manage Templates area, you can then create the email template that you would like to send out to your customers. First, you need to make sure that the Save as a New Template is selected. You would then choose the company that this is going to be for, followed by choosing a banner, You would then give the template a template name as well as a subject because once you, want to, once you send this to your clients, you want to make sure that there is a subject heading so they know what they are opening up. Then you will come over here to the body of the email template. Here you will be able to type in the body of the message. You also have a series of fields that you can choose from. If you don't want to continuously type dear or to, you can simply click on to name. It will then populate here. Then you can start typing your message. Once you, are com once you have completed typing up the message, you will then click on save. Once your template has saved, you can then go to Send a Template. You will then come down to the template information and select the drop-down box, locate the template that you just created and click on it, and it will populate over here to the right. Once it has populated, you can then type in the customer's name, and it will appear over in the right hand side where we have the um, field to name and then you will type in that person's email address. Once you have this information typed in you will then click on send email and once it has sent from our server it will, there will be a message that appears that has told you that the email has sent successfully. Now that you know how to create a template, you can also edit templates that already exist in the database. To do this, you go back up to Manage Templates. Once you are back in the Manage Templates section, you will then go to the Template and select the drop-down box. Then you will need to click on the template that you would like to edit. Once it has finished loading, it will appear over here in the right hand side. And you are free to go ahead and make your changes. Once you have made the changes, you will then want to click on save and then to ensure that the template was updated successfully just simply go back to send a template again you will come down to the template information and select the drop down box and locate the template that you want to view Once that template has finished loading, you will then see it populate over on the right hand side. You can then again go ahead and type in the customer's name and their email address. Then you will click on send email. 
and this concludes how to create and edit a new email template.